And guys, let us look at chronic conjunctivitis. So basically, this is conjunctivitis that lasts for uh, greater than uh, four weeks. That is more than a month. This can be inflammatory, angular conjunctivitis, follicular conjunctivitis like trachoma. Remember, trachoma is uh, chronic and then granulomatous. Usually, granulomatous, you will always learn it in chronic conditions, right? So here, look at the causes. You have back, angular bacterial conjunctivitis that is back, caused by bacteria Moraxella axenfeld. If you remember, this video is already there. This one is uh, angle, right? Angular. It is caused by what? Moraxella axenfeld. There will be mild inflammation. So chronic condition it is. Then trachoma, you already studied uh, the trachoma, chlamydia trachomatis bacteria, serotypes ABC, will cause what? Uh, <coughs> chronic uh, conjunctivitis. Granulomatous conjunctivitis uh, like uh, perinod oculoglandular syndrome. Okay, So, all this will be chronic conditions. Cat scratch disease because of this bacteria, Rocalimaia hensili. That is also because of, um, that is also chronic chronic conjunctivitis. Okay, then lymphogranuloma venereum. Lymphogranuloma venereum actually by chlamydia granulomatis. Uh, lymphogranulomatis, zero varieties L1, L2, L3, that will again be chronic. So if you look at uh, the trachoma where, where we have covered this, so chlamydia trachomatis trachoma, that will be chronic. Chlamydia lymphogranulomatis, that L1, L2, L3, that is also chronic. But in between whatever other things, they can be acute. But chronic, they have mentioned trachoma and this lymphogranuloma venereum conjunctivitis. Then don't forget tuberculosis, syphilis, leprosy. See, tuberculosis, leprosy, you can always remember together. Uh, this tuberculosis of the conjunctiva are very rare. They have said syphilis, all these long-standing, chronic. Tularemia, because of a bacteria, Francisella tularensis. This is because of from some, from some animals, you will get this organism. So that is again going to cause chronic conjunctivitis. Guys, how is it going? Then ophthalmia nodosa, because of hair of certain caterpillars. And some fungus also can cause uh, chronic conditions. Basically, if you notice here, they are not blaming virus that much. Virus, they are not blaming much for chronic infective conjunctivitis. Um, neonatal conjunctivitis, again, this can be chronic or can be acute, right? Because ne neonatal conjunctivitis usually can be caused by many organisms and even chemicals, right? So, what are we trying to look at? Chronic. So, chronic conditions, what do you think? Can this vernal keratoconjunctivitis be chronic? It will be there for seasons, right? And toxic. Look at this. Chronic follicular conjunctivitis can be because of <clears throat> after uh, secondary to molluscum contagious virus. This is the only place they are mentioning virus actually. And uh, it can also be because of some common topical preparations like... Uh, Idozuridine, that is IDU, Iserine, Pilocarpine, DFP, Adrenaline, Neomycin, some preservatives uh, including contact lens solutions. So all these can cause chronic follicular conjunctivitis. Let's take a recap. Chronic conjunctivitis of duration more than 4 weeks can be because of uh, trachoma, right, uh, Bacteria Moraxella axenfeld, that is angular bacterial conjunctivitis. Then you can have because of uh, cat scratch disease, lymphogranuloma, venereum, tuberculosis, syphilis, leprosy, tularemia, ophthalmia nodosa because of caterpillar hair. Fungal ca causes can be there, neonatal, any uh, neonatal conjunctivitis can be either chronic or acute. Allergic conjunctivitis, in that we will have to look at chronic, vernal keratoconjunctivitis that lasts for over the uh, season, right? Toxic, we saw secondary. Remember, this is secondary to molluscum contagious and virus and because of some topical preparations like contact lens solutions, phylocarpine, etc. Look at these images. What do you think this is? Trachoma. This is vernal keratoconjunctivitis. They look very similar, isn't it? The palpebral conjunctiva is affected. So, that's all for now in this video. Bye-bye.